The Wise Cock and the Wicked Fox Once upon a time, there lived a wicked fox in a jungle. One day, it came out of the forest in search of food and entered a village. There lived a wise cock in that village. It was taking rest on a treetop. The wicked fox passed that way. The fox looked up and saw the handsome cock sitting on the branch of the tree. The fox decided to eat the cock. So he said in as sweet a voice as possible. Hello, dear cock. I have brought a good news from the heaven. A new order is passed for all of us. From now on, all the birds and animals will become friends and live together in peace. The cock was surprised. He asked, is it true? The fox replied, Yes, of course. If you would like to test it, why not come down? But the cock suspected him. He started to think wisely. He said, Won't you wait a minute? A few of our friends are coming along. It was the fox's turn to be surprised. Friends, who are coming? What do you mean? The cock answered. Well, I can see some hounds coming. Let us wait for them. On hearing the word hounds, the fox got annoyed. He started to run away. The cock asked, Why are you running? What happened to our friendship? The only reply was, Forget it! Moral Wise men can unveil wickedness. The wolf in sheepskin. Once there was a wolf. He was finding it very difficult to hunt as the shepherds of the area guarded their sheep well. One day, he found the skin of a sheep spread on the ground. He thought, if I wear the skin and get mixed up in the flock, the shepherd will not suspect me. At night, I will kill a sheep and then take him away with me. Covering himself completely with the sheep's skin, he wandered into the pasture nearby. And got mixed up with the flock of sheep grazing there. Soon evening fell and the shepherd led his sheep away back into the fold. As he had expected, the shepherd took him as a sheep.
Aha! Now is my chance, said the wolf, and was about to take off his disguise when the shepherd returned. He had come back to choose one of the animals for its meat for the next day's meal. To the wolf's bad luck, it was he in sheep's disguise who was chosen to be cut up. Evil thoughts have evil ends. <laughs>